11-year-old Tion Horston was a sixth grader at Jefferson Middle School, a son and a dependable friend, according to classmates, at his celebration of life. He was the victim of a deadly shooting last week in the 600 block of North Johnson Street. Since, community leaders have spoken out about gun violence. But Sunday afternoon, his loved ones gathered with activists around his memorial. You know, lost a, a young person at 11 years old, so it really hits home. So we wanted to come out here today to one, support the family, and also to try to bring some, some positivity to the neighborhood. Many there still angry, sad, and left with a lot of questions. It just really sucks that you have a child who was gunned down and no one really has any answers on why it happened and, and who did it. The celebration of life hosted in part by Black Lives Matter South Bend also used as a platform to talk about youth gun violence in South Bend. The organization and Councilman Davis agreeing that something needs to be done to create more opportunities for teens in the city, saying it's no longer a choice but a necessity for their safety. I think we need to have the will um, and the intentionality to implement programs um, at the middle school level. We need the right kind of strategic interventions to be able to work with young people at this age um, who we know to be most at risk. We totally need investment into our kids here in the city. We need to have uh, better after school pro uh, programming. We need to have better recreational programming. We need to make sure our kids are employed, they have jobs. Uh, there's a ton of things that we are missing out on. The shooting is still under investigation by the South Bend Police Department's Violent Crimes Unit. The department has interviewed roughly 20 people. Chief Scott Roskowski says he's confident officers are close to catching the suspect. At the Live Desk Gallery, WSBT 22 News.